Welcome to Rachi's Ubuntu. What you are looking at is the minimalistic Ubuntu desktop shell called Gnome Session Flashback or Gnome Flashback. It does not use any 3D acceleration and is less CPU intensive so it's great for use on older machines or laptops. You have the ability to customize the top and bottom panels allowing you quick access to your frequently used applications. In addition, panel applications allow you to enhance, inform, and or notify you of certain events. Sticky Notes, along with the Linux softwares Gnome Do, Gwake, Plank, as well as several custom keybinds, round out the list as to why I prefer Gnome Flashback as my desktop shell. Sticky Notes is a panel application which allows you to make quick notes, to-do lists, paste copied text from any source, and have them readily available when you need them. It's the first thing that pops up when you log in, informing you what you need to take care of, find out where it is you left off, or scribble a bit of that lyric that has been stuck in your head all week. Gnome Do is a Linux application launcher which can also search for files and execute basic actions on them such as launch, open, email, and others. With a keybind stroke, type in the name of any software installed and you can immediately get to work. You can set Gnome Do to search your music playlist directory, movies, audiobooks, etc. Wake is a drop-down terminal for the Linux operating system. With a couple keystrokes, you can type in or paste your commands. Wake is always available and you don't even have to close it. In a future video, I will cover some custom alias commands that allow you to initiate backups, run updates, join videos, split audio, and more. Plank is a bare-bones stock to launch applications. I use it to launch my music playlists or access my media library. I sometimes keep a few games in there as well. A photographer may want photo apps or graphics tools. A DJ? Music apps, video tools. Use it however you like. Keybinds. Once we have installed the essential software, I will go over keybinds which rounds out the list of why I prefer this setup over any other desktop shell. Over here on the upper left hand corner, I have my office and media apps, code editors and the like. To the upper right, we have the notification area where certain alerts will pop up from time to time. I like to keep my daily logs, shopping apps, a timer over here in this area. The lower left hand corner, I like to keep my internet apps such as browsers, mail clients, transmission, and Pythos, my Pandora app. And finally over to the lower right, I have my system, security, and utility apps. The background I'm using is from the game Tribes 2 called bghammers.png. That was just a quick tour of my desktop setup. You will need to download and install the latest Ubuntu desktop LTS long-term support version, which at the time of this recording is version 18.04.01 Bionic Beaver. Once you have installed Ubuntu, join me in my next video, Ruxy's Ubuntu, Installing the Essentials.